Hey guys, welcome to the Final Fantasy VII Animation Station, Episode 3. This is a series where I show you guys what's going on with the progress of animating the entire bombing run mission. Last time we were here, I did a wedge sketch because I wanted to, you know, just get down a rough idea of how, how we might look inside the animation. Um, but upon doing so, I had to take a quick look at, at something. Now, looking back at the original animation, or not animation, but looking back at the original footage from the game, uh, once the train hits the station, before everybody goes into the uh, first reactor, Biggs jumps off the train first, and he comes off from the top of it here, and he jumps down before he kicks uh, one of these guys. And after Biggs is Jessie, and she runs out from the middle of the train here. And after her is Wedge, and he also jumps down before um, Barrett pops up. So that's the order that I kind of want to change here, starting with Biggs, then Jessie, then Wedge, then Barrett, and finally Cloud that uh, jumps up off from the top. So because of that, I uh, went ahead and redrew the storyboard for it. So let me explain what I what I have here. So this is from a top-down perspective, and it's going to be of Biggs. So let me grab a red. There we go. So this little chibi guy right here, that's Biggs. And we're looking at the train um, from a top-down perspective. He's He's, uh, he's going to be in the middle of two carts and he's going to be holding on to a railing as the train is, you know, the train is going by entering the station. Uh, I drew these arrows here to indicate which way I want the uh, train tracks that are like right here, which way I want the train tracks to move and probably how fast I want them to move as well. I'm not sure what, I'm, I'm not sure what the speed is going to, the speed is going to be yet, but uh, this is going to be the first thing I animate in the next few videos, so stay tuned for that. Um, after that, we also have Jessie. Now she's also hanging on in the middle of two train carts, but it's through a different perspective. Now before I had her looking through a window, but now that... Also, I forgot to point out. <laughs> before I move on, let me point this out. These trains, these are not like passenger trains or anything. This, this is like a a tanker or maybe like a cargo train that holds I'm guessing some type of electricity for the Shinra company or maybe it has some type of nuclear energy that goes into these reactors so there's there's nobody nobody's inside any of these which was my mistake which I should have paid more attention to when I was um, researching and doing the original storyboard but because of that back to my new storyboard Everybody's going to be outside of the train somehow. So we have Jessie here and she's hanging on to the side and she's looking off into the distance as the train is going by at the background of Midgar. And I have these arrows pointing here because this is the direction that the background is going to be. Um, well actually, no, that's wrong. The arrows are supposed to be going this way because that's where the background is that's the movement that the background is going to go is towards the right, not the left. So I need to change that. Um, but yeah, Jesse's looking off into the background as the train is going, as the train is moving. So after that, then we have Wedge. Wedge is going to be on top of the train. He's holding on. He's, he's, we're, we're seeing him from behind, but he's holding, he's more at the top of the train and the reason I have these arrows here is because I'm going to have some type of steam. I'm going to have some type of steam effects going off the train here. And it's going to be blowing by him as uh, as the train is pulling into the station. So after that, we also have Barrett. And like before, Barrett is still from a ground up perspective. The arrows up here indicate which way the night sky or the clouds or I mean there's not really gonna be that many clouds because there's a lot of sky pollution but it's still going to show movement 
and it's going to be going towards the right as the train goes towards the left. Uh, so, after that, we have Cloud. Looking at him just from a front shot here, he looks up into the camera. He's also on top of the train, by the way. But as he looks up, the camera then zooms in and rotates towards the side of him. And once that happens, I don't have it drawn here, but it's going to pull out. The camera's going to pull out as we zoom or as the camera re rotates towards the back of him and the back of the train. And then that's when we go into this nice shot here of the camera, I mean of the train, going into the station before everybody jumps off and kills these guys. <laughs> so that's what I have for a storyboard. And we're going to start off with Biggs. Now, I have him drawn here as a little chibi because, you know, I just wanted to get something quick. I'm really more interested in how this perspective is going to play out with the train and the train tracks and all of that. So, I had to kind of sketch out Biggs here and I'm going to show you guys just a quick, a quick rough sketch of what I came up with. Uh, I mean, there's, there's nothing really too different here. Luckily, there's a lot of references on this guy. And because of the new game that's coming out remake, there's a lot that I can pick from the new design and kind of mix and match with the old design and come up with something that should suit the animation quite well. Like I did with Wedge, I don't want to have too much detail on him. I just want to have that nice amount of detail where it's not too hard to animate. And yeah, you know, um, Biggs came out fine, I think. He just have to, I have to apologize once again for the really, really messy sketch, but it's just something to get on paper real quick so I can visualize um, what direction I want to go with here. Um, other than that, moving forward, next episode, I'm going to be working on that first image or that first panel of the storyboard that I just showed you guys. And I'm going to try to, I'm trying, I'm going to try to finalize the background. I'm going to try to finalize um some parts of what i want to see animated and hopefully from there i can actually show you guys the animatic of it so i'm going to be working on that next week and probably the week after that so definitely um tune into this channel for updates and videos also check the patreon because i also post things there with um more updates and also if you guys have any time to later uh feel free to go ahead and leave some comments or leave feedback on what you think about this series, what you think about the animation station, or maybe there's something that you guys like or you don't like, and you could give me some suggestions of what I could do better, or um, just anything, any questions or anything that comes to mind, let me know and I will reply as soon as I can. So once again, guys, thanks for tuning into this update video. I hope to have a lot more material next time I come around, but until then, you guys have a good one and thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.